This is an update video, basically, to tell you how I'm getting on. I'm about six weeks into my year abroad now, so I thought I'll share a couple of things that I've bought and a couple of the things that I have been doing. Firstly, this is going to be a shock to everyone, but I finally have a new phone and I have gone for an iPhone. It is only an iPhone 5S, I know it's an old model, but I needed something cheap so that I can keep in touch and I went for an iPhone as a bit of an upgrade because it was going to cost me $20, $30 just for a basic phone. Uh, this was 100 but 64 gigabytes and it means that I can take loads of more like photos and things and not relying on my iPod all the time. So that was a really good purchase. So finally I have a new phone. So some of the things that I have been doing. So I've been to two football games already. Uh, when I mean football, I mean college football, or as most other people refer to it, outside the US, American football. And being Houston and being at UH, it is implied that I support the Houston Cougars. So that's what I've been doing, and we've been to, or I've been to two home games so far. I went to Arizona and... <laughs> game which TSU are literally just across the street so that was an interesting rivalry. Especially when we beat them 72-14. I have also been sorting out a bank account which has meant that I have been to downtown Houston again. I got a little video of when we went. Of course, if you know me very well, you will know that when I was in downtown, I happened to go to a famous I wouldn't say famous, a favourite coffee chain. And yes, it did include me buying a new mug, a new Texas Dunkin' Donuts mug, which I am really looking forward to drinking coffee from. Of course, I'm not actually going to use it probably until I get back to the UK. Although I might use it over here. But yeah, I've finally got something to keep my coffee in. Because if you don't know, my last one broke on the handle. That's my DC one from when I went to DC. Also been making a lot of friends and that's why there has not been a video in a while because I've been out with them a lot of the time and I've been gathering bits of videos while I've been with them. It's definitely one thing and it's really nice to be making friends, both American and surprisingly British friends. Uh, that's been really good and I've met people from all over the world which is another thing as well, being an international student, you get involved with more international things. So that's been interesting as well. My new friends have in included me on a numerous amount of adventures. I've been to Walgreens and Walmart and HEB, H-E-B, which is like a Texas supermarket, at interesting hours of the day. Walmart's an interesting experience at about 9, 10 o'clock at night. I've not done a midnight Walmart trip yet, so that's on the cards. I have also been to a famous Houston chain. Saying that it's a chain, it has two stores. It is House of Pies. I went there at 1am. It was absolutely packed with families. How many families go out for a pie at 1am, I do not know. Then again, why did I go to House of Pies at 1am? But yeah, House of Pies. Of course, another big thing in Houston to go and see, um, do, is go to the Galleria, which is one of the biggest shopping malls in America. I think it's the biggest in Texas, if I've got that correct. And that was interesting because it was a lot smaller than I thought it would be. 
A lot of people have been saying that means you've not done it all. But the hype did not seem to meet expectations, let's say. However, that did involve a wonderful trip to, of course, Hot Topic, which I have finally completed. Yeah, 15 year old self is very happy now. Also ended up going to Macy's and a place called the Cheesecake Factory, which I'd never heard of before until I came out this time to America and it turns out to be a big thing. And I can understand why. It, I had a salted caramel cheesecake. It was lush. Also a while I Also, while I was at Galleria, I had managed to pick up something that I have wanted for a while, but have not managed to pick up. I wanted these in DC. Finally got some nice red Converse. And yeah, picked these up out of Foot Locker. They do meet expectations. They are really comfortable. They're a really nice colour. Red for Houston Cougars. Now I just really wanted red Converse and I hadn't actually had any. I'm just so glad I finally got some. So yeah, that is what has been going on the last couple of weeks. And if you don't know already, I'm doing a series while I'm out here known as Texas Experiences, which this video is a part of. So if you haven't already, make sure you check out some of those channel, uh, some of those videos as well, because it'll give you an idea of what is going on. Hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure you give me a big thumbs up down below and you can follow me on my social medias. They are linked or at the bottom and make sure you check out last time's video. I will be seeing you next week with another video which is our five study abroad tips for your first month when you study abroad. So make sure you go and check that out if you're thinking about studying abroad and I will see you in another video soon. Best of luck, goodbye.